you guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, my name is Amanda. Today we're doing kind of a short and sweet Zara haul. I do have several items, but this is really just to show you some of the items that I picked up that I love and some that I don't love. So if you want to hear about all the things that I got, then let's get into the video. Okay, so I can't remember if I showed you guys this item before, but I did pick up a basic black bodysuit. This might be the only boring thing in this haul, but I felt like I was really lacking in this item right here, and it's gonna go with so many of the things that I actually picked up today. So this was an essential. I always get my bodysuits in a medium. I love the way that they fit. I love the double lining in the top, so you don't have to wear a bra, especially because this is a black bodysuit, so you won't see through it or anything weird like that. Um, you know, the, the classic cut of the Zara bodysuit, you really cannot go wrong. The fabric is so soft and so comfortable. I don't really think I need to say anything else about that. The next thing I'm so excited to show you guys is I actually got a bathing suit. This is my first bathing suit I've ever gotten from Zara and disclosure, I don't know if I'm going to be trying this on and showing it to you guys on YouTube. I don't really know what the demonetization guidelines are for showing too much skin or whatever. I mean, I'm sure it's fine, but honestly, I don't even know if I really want to show a bathing suit on YouTube. If you want to see how it looks on, then you're going to have to go follow me on Instagram because I will most likely be posting pictures of me in this bathing suit on Instagram when I go on vacation in a couple weeks. But anyways, I love this bathing suit. You guys know I'm curvy. Okay, I'm thick, I have hips. It's hard for girls like us to find things like this that are super flattering, especially for me. I This season, I don't really wanna be wearing a bikini. I don't really feel like I've put in the work to be, you know, like summer, bathing suit ready, whatever you wanna call it. So really to be comfortable and to just kind of get something that I know I'm gonna wear, I know I'm gonna love and feel comfortable in, I wanted to get something like this. So. It is a one piece bathing suit, but it has cutouts on the side. It's open in the back. So kind of a high waisted bikini cut. The bottom comes up kind of like high on the butt. So I would say this fits maybe like a high rise or mid rise bikini bottom. And then you have the solid back, which actually, I think that the back of this is very flattering. I think it accentuates the smallest part of your waist, which we love. And I love the fact that the inside of it is a nude lining. So if you're someone like me who faked hands and does things like that, then you can appreciate the tan lining on the inside. That just means that you're gonna get it less dirty. And I love that. I mean, white is always hard to wear, especially if you're someone who faked hands. So, but I had to have a white bathing suit. Like it, it was just a must. The middle ring right here is really cool. It's kind of this, I don't know, like it's not tortoise shell, but it's kind of like a beige, almost see-through opaque kind of a material in this kind of like triangle ring. The cups are padded, so that's great. It really gives you good support too. It's very flattering. I have to say all of the lines coming down this way and then the cutout on the side, it was so flattering. I felt so good in this bathing suit. This is definitely a yes for me. Also, I got this in a size large because I was really worried about it being too tight around my hips and my thighs. I really hate when bathing suits are too tight right there and they kind of cut into your skin so you're kind of like bulging out of it and I really wanted to avoid that. So I did get a large. It fits nicely. It's slinky, stretchy material. So I knew that even if I sized up, it would still fit. All right, the next item that I wanted to show you guys are these flowy black cargo pants and these are a great material for summer I feel like and the only thing is I could have sworn when I tried these on in the store which I did try on way before I bought them I swear I tried them on in a medium I swore to myself that I tried them, them on in a medium and I must have been wrong I must have tried them on in a large because the medium was too tight I bought it in a medium and it was too tight so I've already <laughs> reordered them in a large. So I won't be able to show them to you on again. I'll show you a picture of them on the screen, 
but honestly, the first time I tried these on, I absolutely fell in love with them. I just was hesitant because they were $59. And I don't know, I just couldn't, I just didn't pull the trigger at the time. And ever since then, I've been thinking about them. And that's how you know when you really want something, you keep thinking about it, you regret not picking it up. That was me. <laughs> um, and this is the button. I love the cute little gold button there. The cargo kind of pocket. Let's see, what kind of a pocket is this? It's just sort of like a slide your hand in kind of a pocket. It's not an actual like buckle pocket. And there's only a pocket on that one side. It's not on the other side. There's also no pockets in the back. And it's a zip front and it has these pockets on the side and the front. So absolutely love these. They're flowy. They're very comfortable. They're very flattering and you can wear these in so many seasons because they're black. So nobody needs to know. Okay, these pants I've had my eye on for a very long time. You know that one item when you order a whole bunch of things and there's that one item that you're looking forward to? This was that for me. I ordered these in a medium. Now they do fit, they're comfortable, they are flattering, they're nice, I love the fabric. I feel like I want to try them on in a large just to see because they are quite fitted around my butt and they're kind of because of that they're kind of lower waisted than I thought they were going to be so I do love them I love the way that they look I like the way that they fit I just would like to compare both sizes you know what I'm saying but they're a beautiful flowy material these are going to be great for vacation beach wear the waist of them is like scrunchy. There's no tie or anything like that. They're literally just a scrunchy waist. So, I mean, I don't think that's a bad thing. I think that they just make the size fit of them a little bit more versatile. And this is a medium. You guys know, usually when I buy pants from Zara, they're a large. I always have to size up um, with the exception of certain items. But these are a medium and they fit. So I feel like they do run more true to size. All right, this one I'm going to show you guys. I was not sure about this when I was getting it, but I felt like I really wanted to give it a try. It's like a white satin midi skirt with that gathering in the front. It has the slit going up the side, and I felt like this looks really good when you style it with a graphic t-shirt and some heels. It's very kind of like cool, effortless fashion. I got this in a medium. The ruching right here in the front is sort of off to the side a little bit. There is a zipper down the middle of the back of it and then there's kind of like scrunched ruching on the butt. This, The fit of this was fine. It's a medium so it's true to size. I would stay true to size if you get skirts like this. In fact, most of the time when I get skirts like this from Zara that are a midi skirt, I stay true to size. The only thing is you guys, I'm on the fence about this. I don't know if it feels like it looks cheap and it kind of turns me off a little bit. I don't know if it's because I didn't steam it or anything like that. It's not like super thin satiny material, but I don't know, I just feel like it's giving a little cheap and I, I'm on the fence. You guys let me know. Okay, this stunner right here, I've been wanting to get for a minute. I've actually had it sitting in my closet for a minute as well. I just haven't showed it to you guys yet because I was waiting for this haul but I love this thing. It's a midi zebra print skirt and I think it's a linen blend material, I wanna say. I love the way that this fits. This would be so cute with a white t-shirt or a black bodysuit, a cropped linen blazer. That's really what I wanna wear it with is that white cropped linen blazer. I think that would be so cute with some chunky black sandals or something like that. Very easy to wear in summer. Very stylish, but still super comfortable. I like the detail here. It's kind of ruched and scrunched, and then you have the slit down the front of it. The slit does kind of go a little high, so I don't know, I'm thinking, I don't, I haven't like walk tested it or anything like that, but I'm thinking like if you want to be super secure in it, I might kind of like throw a little safety pin just so that it doesn't open any higher than it should, okay? This was a great buy, true to size. I got a medium. I absolutely love the skirt. She's not going anywhere. Now this top that I got, I feel like is going to go so nicely with a bunch of the things that I got in this haul today. 
It'll go really nicely with the flowy cargo pants once, once I get those in the right size. It'll go super nicely with these cover-up pants. It'll go really nicely with the zebra print skirt. So I just think that this is a great top. So this one is a linen top that ties on the side. And I'm really sorry if you hear any background noise. My dog is over here, as usual, soaring and being nosy. And then my son is in the background, so sorry. So if you stalk the website like me, you'll notice that there's another linen top that's very similar to this one. The difference is that the other one has just a tie in the front. You bring it together with just the two sides. The difference about this one is that it ties and unties on both sides in, on the inside, I guess you'd say. Oh my God. Zeus is literally the loudest thing that I know in this world. So if you look right here, so this opens like this and then you tie it to the side right here. It has sort of an elastic scrunchy back right there. And then you can also tie the other side there. So it opens just like a linen top, like any normal top would. Um, but the difference is that you can tie this side over here and you can tie this side over here. You can just leave it open. You can tie the two fronts together right there. So I think there's so many different ways that you can wear this and tie it and style it. And I love that idea. I got this one in a medium because they didn't have a large, but honestly, I'm kind of glad that I got a medium. Um, I was thinking I'd want a large just to kind of give me a little bit more flow, a little bit more give, a little bit more like effortless, comfy feeling, but the medium is great. True to size, love it. All right, and a dress that I picked up, I've had my eye on this one for a long time too. I love this dress. The only thing is that it's a medium. They didn't have it in a large, you guys know. With dresses at Zara, I always size up and get a large because of the size of my hips, I feel like that's where I always lose the fabric and that's where I need the most fabric. So I love the effortless flowy vibe of this dress and I love the color of it. I love this, the fabric is also really soft. It's very lightweight and airy. Um, the only thing is when I tie it around, I wanna tie it kind of loosely, but I find that if I leave it a little bit too loose, I don't feel like there's enough overlapping fabric in the front here because of my hips. So I think that a large would be great because you get more fabric and then you can tie it really the way that you want to. I don't know, that's that's just how I think about it in my head. So I might try and size up with this. It has this gorgeous kind of tortoise ring here. The belt goes from this side and loops all the way around and then the sleeves are super flowy. I just think this is a great, easy to wear, effortless dress for summer and I, the color and everything about it is just me. And last but not least, I got some sandals that were so overdue. I was really overdue for some white sandals. These are super cute. They are more of like a creamy off-white color than a pure white. I kind of, from the website, they look pure white, but um, yeah, in person, they're more of an off-white. They're very comfortable. I sized up and got a nine. My true to size is a US eight. And I did that because I have a brown pair of sandals from Zara that are leather, but they still, I, I bought those true to size in my size eight, and they are just a little tight. Um, a little tighter than I'd want them to be. So I find that if you size up in the sandals, they fit a lot more comfortably and better in my opinion. And I think all of these items are perfect for vacation. I'm going on a lake vacation for about a month. I'm gonna be there. My, my family has a lake house. So that's where you guys will be seeing me in my vlogs. And if you wanna see me in all of these outfits, then follow me on Instagram and TikTok because that's where I do mini vlogs. I'm going to be showing my outfits in reels and things like that. So make sure you come say hi and show your girls some love on Instagram and TikTok. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was short and sweet, but sometimes that's how we like it. A little short and a little sweet. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.